Hello, fanatics. Hi. Reese is over there playing his game. Welcome, or welcome back to Diamond Painting Fanatics. I am Cindy, and we're doing a kitten up video today, but I have to show you the canvas. Most of you will have seen it on my Monday Night Live, but for those of you who haven't, this is Rio. How gorgeous is he? He is licensed in my store. I will link it down below in the description box. But this is by uh, Relaxed Introvert on Instagram. He is a 50 by 70. And I got him in rounds because I have gone squares with all of my kits. So the last three that I bought, I bought in rounds just to break it up. But how adorable is he? I will bring should've you. Should have got rounds. Pardon? Should have got squares. I did get. You said you should have got rounds. I did get okay. rounds. But I got squares with all of my other kits apart from three. So I know. I love squares. But I wanted a round. So. Yeah. We have 46 colours, we have 4 ABs. Now, I have relaunched re because I have a new logo on the top of the canvas, which matches all of my other branding. So I have tied it in with my YouTube channel. Yay! I will still be working on my stash from everywhere else, but... Yeah, I, I love him, but how cute is he? He's just so cute. So, with the rebranding, uh, we do now also, I'm going to flip this over while we kick it up, but let's pop that up there. We also now get sticker sheets. How awesome is that? Now, the new orders that have just gone out have sticker sheets. Apart from one person, I forgot to put them in her box. <laughs> but they are on the way. Uh, but we do have sticker sheets. And you have your model number, which will match your canvas. It is a round, and it is a 50 by 70. And we have Rio in all of his glory. There he is. Uh, we have... 46 colours and on the bottom here we have four ABs so they will be out of order here so it goes from 8 to 10 because 9 is here um, and the same with it goes from 8 to C because A is here because it's an AB so this will be out of sync but I will put it in sync when I kit up because I'm a bit like that so a very good friend of mine was a little bit confused as to what this is. And I can assure you, I will go from this end because I haven't tried this end. If you peel away the white piece from the yellow piece, just use the tip of your thumb or your finger. There we go. Might take a minute, but it peels away and it is indeed a sticker sheet. Now, when I announced that we had sticker sheets, Everyone was like, yes! My friend is a little confused. So, I'm going to show you how to do it. Now, let me just grab my stores back in the camera. I am going to be using my Art Dot container. It has 60 pots and a net. I love my Art Dot cases. You all know this. So, I'm going to pop that there. Now, what I do... The easiest way that I have found to do this is I'm going to now because they're quite wide I'm not sure the whole thing isn't going to fit on so I don't save my drills even my own I don't save them so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to just pop 
probably isn't the best way to do it because I'm going to need the DMC to kit up. I can always use the canvas, it's fine. Right, so I have neatly cut up the side that I want to use. I don't need this piece anymore, not yet anyway. Uh, then I'm going to cut across, keeping it all nice and neat that way. And I'm going to cut the numbers off as well because I don't need those. I've probably taken a copy of this before I began but I haven't kitted up in a long time because I have been working on all of my kits that I've kitted up so there we go then I'm just gonna I'm just gonna roughly cut down here now the important bit we need Is we need to peel this away from here just this corner put my scissors down uh, please there we go got it it's a little bit fiddly but what we do is now I'm just going to peel this away from the numbered bit, not the symbol bit, because I need the symbol bit. Now, I peel this away from there, and then I'm going to cut the numbers off. So I'm left with just the symbol like so. It gone a little bit off line there, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be pretty and perfect. And then we're left with the symbol like this. Right, so then we just cut each symbol into the yellow paper. Not all the way through. I work by the symbol, so that's why I'm keeping the symbols. I don't necessarily need the DMC code because it is on the legend. On the actual canvas. So, there we go. And then we do the same on this side. Peel it away, like so. Once you get used to the method, it's fine. But I, I haven't done this for a very long time. Yeah, and there we go. So I just fold that just neatly out of the way so I don't chop it off. And sit that down there. And then I'm going to cut the DMC numbers off on this side. And do the same again. Gorgeous colours in this kit for sure. 
Oh, we've got all the threes. And there you go. So then you just cut the label again. I love sticker sheets. I don't know about everyone else, but I love sticker sheets. Do you like sticker sheets, Reese? Yeah. It just sticks onto the pots. It does indeed. Oh. And there we go. It's that now we can go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And then the eight is a uh, an A B, hence it's over here. So A and C. There we go. Now I've got my container. Oh, you didn't see any of that. Don't think. Oops, sorry. I've got my container. I've got my stickers. Do you know the one thing I haven't got? Hi. My drills. I will be right back. <laughs> Here they are. So we do also have an inventory sheet which will help me because I've just cut up all of the relevant information. So I can use this mm -hmm. instead. And we should have 47 bags. One, two, yeah. Okay, so here we go. We'll put that into one side. Okay, it's voiceover time and Saturday Charity. I thought I'd add it on the end of this video because, oh, why not? So, hopefully, I've helped with sticker sheets, and that's what they are for. Not for the bin, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, it's a bit fiddly, but once you, I, I prefer it. Um, I enjoy kitting up. I enjoy the whole kitting up process. So, you know. But I hope you are all well, and still enjoying spring flings. I do hope you're still enjoying it. I am working on my spring meadow. Yes, I have done some more. Um, I think one more row and I am halfway. If maybe a bit more, I don't know. But I'm enjoying spring meadow. Um, and of also, I think the secret is out of the bag. If you saw my Monday night live, you will know that I am working on Rio. Now I was kitting it up for Crafting with Kay. She is hosting a Summer Fun 23 diamond painting event. Um, I was kitting it up for that but once all the drills were in the containers yeah kind of placed some and now I'm sailing through that as well so yeah two whips on the go trying to get spring meadow finished that is my mission for this month um yeah uh, it's a little bit scary we're running out of time we're running out of time i do want to uh take part in another event that's happening in may uh with nick's 
and that's Phoenix Fantasy. And I want to work on Reaper of Souls for that. But Crafting with Kay is doing summer colours. Anything bright, vibrant or anything that reminds you of summer. Her event information is up on YouTube. So please do go check that out. Um, I'm pretty sure you have something in your stash that will fit in with that. That is from the 1st of June to the 31st of July and you never know I might just be sponsoring but you'll have to check out the video to find out for sure but yeah I am um, I'm feeling a bit rough today I'm not gonna lie I'm feeling a bit rough oh yeah um Okay, so, I am, dare I say it out loud, I am 25 orders away from 200. 25 away from 200. It blows my mind. It does blow my mind. So, I have decided, once I get 200 orders, I think on my Monday Night Live, once I hit the 200, I am going to do a Monday Night Giveaway. Yes, I think I am. I think I've come up with the... um the idea for it now I was kind of asking my friends and yeah I think I've come up with an idea so once we get there I will let you know and on the Monday Night Live we will um do a giveaway Monday where we do giveaways throughout the whole live Dun, dun, dun. What's going to be up for grabs? You'll have to wait and see. But yeah, I thought that was a good um, idea. Uh, we have a new artist this week. You may have seen already. Celestial Jax is our newest artist. Uh, what an amazing artist he is. Um, yeah, really new really new to diamond painting um so <laughs> it's so interesting meeting newbies and they're like what what is rounds and what is squares um really basic questions and i love it i love coming back to basics uh yeah so <laughs> what's an ab how do you put the drills down it it's awesome and it brings you back to do you remember the very first diamond painting you ever did yeah i i was waiting for um ebay to deliver um and me and my son we went to the range and they had these little um kiddie kits in there i think i got like a mermaid or something and reese had one I can't remember what his was. Yeah. Um, the minute I started placing drills, I was so excited to get my kits from eBay. They used to do things like buy six for four or something silly. But they are the silly little partial ones. But if any of you posted on your Facebook news, you know, your Facebook profile feed... Every year you'll get, oh, three years ago today you did this. And you're like really proud of this panda hugging a tree that's a partial. And you're like, I'm really proud I did this. And um, yeah, look how far we've come because we're doing um, 
massive canvases now. Uh, we wouldn't even entertain the partial panda hugging a tree. <laughs> but yet we loved it at the time. It's really bizarre, isn't it? But we learn these things and we grow and we expand and we we test our um, abilities, so to speak. But yeah, it's all good fun. Reese is really ploughing through Rick and Morty. Whoa, he's really ploughing through that. He's doing an awesome job. And I love that, um, I think it's Helen. Helen always asks Reese how he's doing with his diamond painting. And uh, he loves showing it off. And he reckons by Monday he will only have the top section left to do. So we shall see if that's true. He could um, whack it out because it is multi-placing. But that's just me being ambitious. Oh, what else is new? Not a lot. So the new releases this week was United as One by Celestial Jacks. We have Lover's Vortex, which I know one of my very dear friends was very excited. <laughs> Kept refreshing the page every half an hour. <laughs> Rather than just say, uh, Cindy, can you release it now, please? Okay, thank you. Um, yeah, Lover's Vortex. And we have... What big red eyes you have from relaxed introvert as well. Now, I have this one in person and I love it. I do love it. It's not my usual thing, to be honest. I like um, cute and fluffy usually, but I do like a canvas with a story. And each three of these have a story so yeah I I have my own stories I don't like to sort of throw that on you because you may see something completely different to what I see so you can make up your own stories which I think is what zone paintings are all about I do enjoy it. Oh, you guys. Oh, you guys. I am on season seven. I can't remember episode number, but I'm quite deep into season seven. And OMG. I sat there with my headphones on because Reese was on the Xbox on the sofa and I'm diamond painting and then I put my pen down and I'm just sat watching because I watch it all on my laptop and I'm sat watching it and then Reese just came over and hugged me and he was like are you okay mum and I'm like yeah I'm fine I was sobbing like a baby oh my goodness me yeah I was you idiots but yeah I was sobbing and um like Reese was hugging me going what's the matter so I told him what happened and he went it's just a tv show it was so funny I know, but you get very invested, is what I said. Um, <laughs> oh, it's mad. It is mad how we get so invested in a show. And um, I don't know. But yeah, I did. Oh, I don't mind admitting it. <laughs> and even feeling daft afterwards. What? 
That's what it's all about. Yeah. If you're not enjoying it, you won't be watching it. Oh, I've got to catch up on the wrestling. Oh, my baby's back. My baby was back last week. I want to see if he's got anything to say this week. I have to watch that over the weekend. Ooh. I do love my wrestling. Well, oh, earlier... And I mean, not that long ago, I did say we are 25 orders away from 200. I can now tell you we are 23 orders away from 200. Oh, wee. Yep, more orders are coming in. Thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, I, I'm so excited and... We will be doing um, a Monday night giveaway very soon. Um, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, 23 orders away. Um, okay, your code word for today is Blossom. Dun, dun, dun. The reason I chose this word is because there's a tree in my back garden and um it's um i don't know um kind of what tree it is but it's got all white blossom on it and i love looking at it when it's all flowered and um, my car is probably covered in it um on the other side of the fence but i absolutely love it so that is your code word for today and i have hidden it in the middle of the video because some of you like to Roll on to the end, and um, yeah, I've hidden it in the middle. So there you go. Blossom is your word today. So what are you all working on? I'm working on both Rio and Spring Meadow, and I'm loving them. I'm loving them both. Uh, Rio is really coming to life, and uh, yeah, that's around. So during the day, I sit and do Spring Meadow. And I do a big section. Uh, <laughs> I should really learn to just do one release sheet at a time. Um, it might go a bit quicker because it's so confetti heavy. But I'm I'm loving it. I do I do love that kit, and um, I want that in my dining room when it's done. And I'm also loving on Rio. He's so bright and vibrant, and the colours are amazing. So. I'm really, really enjoying that kit as well. Um, what else can we chat about, you guys? I don't really know. We have more releases. If you are a Fanatic family member, or a Fanatic member of... You're either a, a support member or a Fanatic family member... You will have seen this week's releases. Um, well, three of them. I will do a bonus one. Because I'm very spontaneous on my Monday Night Lives. And, yeah. Ooh. One Fanatic family member couldn't resist and um, purchased a kit. A very large one. Um, I can't wait to see that um, when that arrives. All orders are in, other than the ones that have come in today, obviously. All orders are in. So we're looking at around two weeks, roughly, before you start getting your orders. I'm so excited. I have actually put none in for myself this time. So I think I'm going to have to change that. Uh, yes, I think I'm going to have to change that. I'm going to have to find some for me. Um, hmm, interesting. But yes, uh, what else? What else has been going on? Not very much. I haven't um, been anywhere or really done anything. I say that I'm working hard on my website. I'm working hard um, on my social medias. 
um, and of course my YouTube I'm trying to upload more and more videos for you guys as well so yeah th there's just a whole lot going on uh, Diamond Painting Gamer has unboxed her crystal tree uh, and I can tell you I've sold quite a few since so uh, thank you Diamond Painting Gamer uh, yeah, we had a whole, uh, we had a chat. Um, I hope Saturday went well. I won't say what you were doing, uh, because you know, it's it's your business. And um, we had a chat briefly, but I hope Saturday went really well, and everything is exciting and building there. Um, wow, how a year passes very quickly, huh? But I just. I hope everything went well. And Crafting with Kate is building up to her event, which is amazing. June and July. Um, I know what kit I'm working on. It's not released yet, so I will have to release it soon. But I know what kit I am working on. Um... What else is going on? Do, do, do. My kids are on the computer right now, so I'm upstairs recording this for you guys. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It is uploaded for Saturday. It's just later than usual. I like to upload it in the morning, but I was running on... Um, I think it ended up being 27 hours with no sleep, and I just crashed. And... Um, yeah, so it is up for Saturday, but it's a little bit later than usual. But Sharon won't mind because she likes to diamond paint on the evening, listening to Saturday Chatterday. So, uh, yeah, I do apologise. I am I am super busy and, yeah, I just get distracted and I don't sleep very well. It's one of my downfalls. I know Kay does worry about me, but it's insomnia. There's nothing you can do. No amount of hot chocolate or hot milk. Eel. I don't like hot milk, but no amount of um, night oil is going to knock you out. Um, no amount of anything. It's just something I've lived with for... Uh, oh, God, blimey. Um, 20, 30 years. So it's going to be hard not to just... You know, to put yourself to bed at ten o'clock every night and 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 have that happen. That's the joys of having depression, anxiety, post traumatic stress disorder, and just not sleeping. So it all plays part and parcel. If I'm stressed, if I'm worried, it impacts. Uh, I don't sleep. I don't eat very good and stuff like that. So it's just something I've lived with. Um and. I will probably always be like that. So, yes. A lot of you probably can relate, but... Ooh, I do have some exciting news. Hannah Lipsky, um, a.k.a. Iterations Crafts on Instagram, an amazing, talented artist that I have here in Diamond Painting Fanatics, She's amazing. Um, we do chat quite often, and yeah, she she's she's amazing. And um, I've asked her if she would like to come on my Monday night live. So we're organising when is best for that. I'm hoping the first of May. Um, yeah, let's walk into May and um. Yeah, I'm very, very excited about having Hannah. She's very knowledgeable on a lot of things. Um, it will be an open discussion. It will go wherever chat takes us. Um, it may cover... Um, yeah. I live on a main road, and that's annoying. Um, the chat will go wherever it takes us. Um, we are very open here at Diamond Paint and Fanatics, and... There's going to be a whole host of things we're going to be talking about. So, 
I'm very, very excited and I'm going to give Hannah the floor and she's, she's going to run with it and whatever we chat about, we chat about. And I'm, I'm very, very excited about having Hannah join me on my Monday Night Live. I'm super excited. Uh, I've seen her in a couple of lives and she's awesome. She's just awesome. Um, yeah, um, the, my, my door is always open if you want to come join me on Monday nights. Um, I know Angel wants to come join me and that would be amazing as well. Um, maybe, um, in May as well. I think May is mental health month, isn't it? So that would be quite fitting because, um, yeah, I, I want to, I want to open the door to mental health because I think a lot of us who dive and paint do struggle with mental health issues, um, you know, depression, anxiety, post-traumatic stress disorder, uh, all, a variety of, of of mental health issues. And I want to be open and I want to be, have that door opened to, to talking about um, life struggles and um, stories that you, you have gone through. And, you know, in the chat as well as um on camera and um anyone is free to you know contact me and come join me uh, it doesn't have to be mental health related it can be anything related uh, event related whatever whatever the door, the door is always open and um yeah i'd love to have you have more guests join me on my monday night lives and as you know i um start at eight o'clock on a Monday and I finish whenever I finish on a on a Tuesday morning usually but yeah the doors are always open you and you have to contact me via Instagram Facebook or email and you can come join me and um the door is always open as they say I'm very excited I do love Hannah I'm not gonna me, you you will see me fangirling over her because she's just amazing, and um, I'm very fortunate that we've become quite close. I'm a relaxed introvert as well. We've become very close friends, and um, yeah, I'm I'm very excited. I am very excited, and you know, I'm lots of new artists coming forward. I have a new artist that I'm, I'm talking to right now, and. Every, everything is just moving forwards and it's amazing um truly truly amazing i'm very very excited where life is taking us now i need to go get a cup of tea i've asked my children twice i'm still being ignored so i'm gonna go and make a cup of tea and i'm going to uh, get this uploaded for you guys before you all start inboxing me and yelling at me where's saturday chatterday so you have your code word you have your new releases for this week and yeah i i will see you on monday night at 8 p.m will we be doing our monday night giveaway by then Ooh, that's interesting 23 away now what you know that would have seemed like really ambitious a couple of months ago but yeah i'm getting orders almost daily now and that's it's so exciting and it's you know down to you guys and thank you thank you so much for joining me um, and supporting my business, and <sighs> I'm excited, what can I say, I'm very, very excited, right, I'm going to love and leave you, I hope the sticker sheet um, helped, well you guys, I'm going to love and leave you, I did indeed get a cup of tea, but I need to get going and diamond painting and housework Ugh. don't just hate it when housework gets in the way so annoying but yes 
adulting sucks, doesn't it? And yeah, I will see you on Monday, you guys. I'm so excited. Um, yeah. Monday Night Live. Woo! More releases. Um, yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for joining me today. And um, good luck. I will draw a winner on Monday for a voucher and a gift card. And yeah, I'll see you there. Happy diamond painting. Love, hugs and sparkles to you all. Bye.